Yeah, I want to take notes on that one. <clears throat> All right, let's hit it. Hey, everybody. This is Agent Ice, and we're back with some more old school Sonic. I've been playing a lot of the 3D Sonic games, and I have to say, I really do appreciate these old Genesis titles. These are what I grew up on. These are what I love. Well, I mean, I didn't grow up on CD, and I'm not even sure I like CD, but, you know, Sonic the Hedgehog, Sonic 2, Sonic 3, and Knuckles, I absolutely enjoy these games. And <clears throat> actually, back when I was a kid, I had Sonic and Knuckles, I didn't have Sonic 3, but I saved up. I saved up all like my birthday money, my Christmas money, you know, I did whatever work I could, saved up allowance, and really mostly with a bunch of change, I ended up getting enough money together to buy Sonic 3, and then I was finally able to have the full experience. And let me tell you, just playing Sonic and Knuckles on its own, it sucked and you know why it sucked because you could not save your game in sonic and knuckles that was only available for sonic 3 or with sonic 3 and knuckles if you attached your cartridges together like having that was a huge game changer because i was only allowed to play for like an hour maybe hour and a half a day so it was I was essentially speed running before it was a thing trying to get through the game to see if I could beat it because I had to beat it super quick and that that just made everything a lot easier for me so <clears throat> yeah it was awesome totally worth it and you know now you don't even have to worry about any of that stuff that comes packaged so I guess the question here is I do want to play Sonic 3 and Knuckles, but what version should we play? Should we play the normal anniversary mode? Or should we do mirror mode and play the game in reverse? That's the real question. And honestly, unless somebody in the audience has a preference, I think I'll leave it up to a coin flip. So, speak now, or forever hold your peace, and we will let luck decide. Alrighty, let's flip a coin. Heads anniversary mode, tails mirror mode. Well, look at that. It is tails. We are playing this game backwards. So a while back when I did play these all in mirror mode, I eventually got used to playing the game that way to the point where playing it normally actually felt really effed up. Now that I've readjusted to moving from left to right most of the time, I'm sure this is going to throw me through a whole loop all over again. <laughs> Alright, so... I've already beaten this once with every character. Actually, I guess I beat it twice with Tails. Cool. Let's see, who do we want to pick here? We got Sonic and Tails, just Sonic, just Tails. I don't, I'm not going to do Tails. I already beat it with him twice in this map. We got my boy Knuckles. Hmm. You know what? You know, we're actually going to do Sonic and Tails. That's how we're going to play this. 
Oh god, this is already... Already messing with me. So I've been watching videos. This is what I do, right? I watch videos about Sonic. <clears throat> and I guess they found that there was originally plans for a different intro there where Knuckles just kind of motioned you to follow him. And I guess that changed, that plan changed, and now, you know, we have what we have, where he pops out of the ground and knocks the emeralds out of you. Very interesting. And really just, I think Sonic and Knuckles in general, very interesting game. It was supposed to all be one game, but Sega had to get something out the door. They needed to make money, and also I guess they had some kind of promotional thing with McDonald's, because they had like little Sonic the Hedgehog toys with the Happy Meals. And so they were like, okay, we, we gotta get something out. And so what happened is they finished up what they were working on, and they sent half the game out the door. And you can tell playing, I mean, there's certainly a... There's a difference, I might even go as far as to say general quality difference between Sonic 3 and Sonic and Knuckles levels. Not that it's like huge, that the Sonic 3 levels suck and you know, anything like that, but it feels a little bit better and also there's more Knuckles specific routing in the, the, uh, the Sonic and Knuckles half of the game. That's just how it is. But that's okay. You know, both both parts of the game by themselves ain't too bad. Ain't too bad. And again, I thought it was kind of cool how they had to lock on technology. So. And also with that, we were able to play Knuckles in good old Sonic 2. So that was pretty cool. And if you really like to get the Blue Spheres minigame, well, you could play it to your heart's content, because they had... It just robbed me. Dang, game! Okay. I guess I don't really need to worry about this. There's no lives. I'm maxed out on coins, because I've played this game way too much. Trying to remember if I have the MJ Music mod installed still. I don't quite remember. I hope so, because personally I like the MJ tracks. Oh, we got this bonus level. This has to be my favorite one out of all. Glowing Spears, I think is what it's actually called. Oh my gosh. Kind of kind of messed up there a little tiny bit. Oh no, it's coming for me. Just like death. You can't escape death and you can't escape that thing at the bottom of the level. Alright, well I got everything I needed. It's okay if I go into that. You don't get anything special for getting out. I've also been looking a lot into the music for this game recently because 
I generally really enjoy the soundtracks for these Sonic games. They just do such a good job. They really do. <clears throat> Let's see. And there's all kinds of video. There was, uh, was it Music Theory with something and, and Knuckles? And a lot of that was interesting. We talk about the actual composition part of the music. And, you know, half the stuff, I mean, I'm not, I'm no music major, I'm no composer. I'll admit, a lot of that stuff kind of goes over my head. But I kind of get the gist of what he's saying. And it's still really interesting because you kind of, you know, it's almost like looking, having a, a glimpse of the mind of the person who composed the music. For the levels, you know. Really, really cool stuff. In my opinion. And then there's some videos too. <clears throat> I don't, I don't really understand the oscilloscopes very well, but this person has like a program or something that kind of gives you a visualization of the music and different channels and stuff for it too. And I thought that was pretty cool because they isolate different parts of the music and kind of play them by themselves, and you kind of. You get to hear things you wouldn't normally hear. And it gives you a whole new appreciation for the music, which is already awesome, even if you don't know about all that. And sometimes even just the isolated parts are worth listening to. Like, they could have chucked the rest of it out and it would have still been fine. And... There's oftentimes just a lot in general going on. So, definitely, definitely have a lot of respect for the people that did the music composition for, for this game. They did a phenomenal job. Oh, I didn't want to pick that up. Okay, I don't... Yeah, I think I do have. Hey, memory didn't serve me well. But I got another fire shield, which kind of doesn't matter. I'm going to lose it soon. It's <laughs> like, oh my gosh. The breakdown for the music for Angel Island, especially Zone 2. Oh man. It's it's pretty nuts. It really is. A lot of these games, they like the the games, the tracks, they have some pretty good bass parts too. Really good. I don't know. I would strongly suggest checking out some of those videos. If you like the music at all, check those out. You might be amazed what you find out. I think it's really cool and gain a whole new appreciation for the soundtrack of this game. I already kind of messed up getting a perfect so And really, you know, if we were playing classic mode, the perfect would matter more, maybe, if I planned on dying a lot, because you get continuations. Not really too concerned with that. Getting this emerald. Bam! That's what I'm talking about right there. I usually try to grab these as soon as I can. In some ways, though, I almost. 
wouldn't even mind running and not getting them all just so I could take advantage of this little move. I mean, you'll see some people use it, but that little... I don't even know what the, the word for it is. I think... If I remember right, the guidebook calls it like a temporary shield, but it everything in that range will get hit. And it'll protect you for that split second it's up from a lot of things, so... It's actually pretty nice. It's pretty cool. I do have to go this way. Yeah, playing this game in reverse, it, I have to think. Now, the first time I did this... Oh, man. Like, I could feel my brain working in overtime trying to figure out how to look at everything. Because nothing, of course, was laid out the way that you know, I was used to seeing it. So it had to, like, remap everything. It was a very strange feeling. Okay, we need to get... some jank here. I think it's... Crap, what side is it on? Oh, it was on the left. I could have... Done goofed. Yeah, I'm not even gonna worry about the perfects. I mean, yeah, they're cool, but... Uh, I've done it all before in other runs. It takes more time, and there's really no benefit to it. This one's always fun. You just do the whole outs. Out of the and that's it. Boom, you're done. All those spheres. I think it's a cool little mini game. I don't know if it was always planned to work the way that it does, but it's pretty cool. It's probably my favorite mini game to do for the Emerald. Anybody who may not have heard, there is going to be DLC released for this game here. I want to say next month, end of next month, where they are adding... I forget how many game... Gosh darn it. The heck? Oh! What? I just got trolled. They're adding a bunch of Game Gear games to the museum uh, section of this game. For crying out loud. I have bad timing. Story of my life. Alright. See, that time I probably could have made it. But. Oh my. That's. But the part that I'm really looking forward to is the fact that Amy Rose is going to be a playable character in all four of these games. I think that's awesome. I actually don't... Uh, don't mind her as a character. I think it could be fun. You know what? I'm just gonna... I, I think it's because it's the other way around. I just... I can't... I can't do that. <laughs> that's my excuse. Come on, Tails. So one thing that's really good about this version of the game, in the original, Tails would kind of have this trouble following you, and so when he caught up to you, he would stop moving, and that would put him in the back, and then he'd just get hit with every single bomb that fell from that thing.
I mean, it was kind of funny to watch, but, you know, it's kind of nice they fixed that. There are some things, though, with this version of the game I don't care so much for, like, the fact that it's infinitely easy... I screwed that up. It's infinitely easier to fall to your death. I could have lived without... Well, not fall to your death, excuse me. Get squished. You get squished so easily in this version of the game. And I don't know why. I don't know if you play classic if it's different. But... Like, I get squished by stuff that really probably shouldn't have. That in the other version of the game, you know, it would just slide. Oh, here we go. Okay, I do have the modded. Sweet. We don't have to listen to the bad music. Oh, I don't want to go hard right here. Yeah. I know with this, so... I was watching a video with some... I think it was actually one of the ones where they were talking about the music. Yeah. So... This guy was talking about this zone. And he kept saying Hydrosity. And I'm like... Hydrosity? Because I always called it Hydro City. And I'm like, all right, what, like, what's going on? And I, I caught somebody else calling it that too in one of their videos. So of course, I'm like, well, have I been, have I been saying it wrong all these years? Am I, am I stupid? And honestly, I think it is actually pronounced hydrous. Personally, I think it is most certainly. Hydro City. It's just the way that they did the text. You know, there's no space. And I watched a really interesting video about this yesterday where the guy was trying to get to the bottom of what it's supposed to be. And you did have some, you know, Sega people say, hey, yeah, like it's, you know, they call it Hydro City. And. You know, there's a few other supporting pieces of evidence that they... Oh, wow, I fell right through. Oh, it's sweet. I'll take that. But at the end of the day, I think I was right all along, and it is Hydro City. Even though Hydro City does sound kind of cool for a zone name, it's not... Uh... It just doesn't seem likely that's how they wanted it. What it is and how it's pronounced. And if you look at the... Oh, is it the jukebox thing in Sonic Generations? It's called Hydro City. Like, there is a space there. So, I don't know. Like I said, it's one of those things that's kind of doesn't really matter at the end of the day a whole lot, no, but, you know, it's still interesting and it leaves a lot of people wondering if they've been saying it right, calling it the right thing, you know, whatever. Alright, let's bag this emerald and get out of here. Beautiful. We already got five of these bad boys. I don't know if I'm going to get enough to go super by the end of Hydro City or not, but honestly, at the end of the day, I don't care that much. And I normally, normally do get all these. Oh, we're at the boss. Yep. Whoops, I screwed up. Yeah, that's what you want to do. You want to try to, like, zoom up and then catch him kind of on that top corner and then bounce up into the middle and you just, you just abuse him to death. Which, you know, it sounds pretty terrible the way I worded that, but that's what you do. I 
almost want to try a glitch thing. I don't. I doubt it would work in this game. If you do kind of spin dash there where I did, you can make it up, and it gives you a little bit of a leg up on that wall of doom closing in on you. Otherwise, it's more of a close call, at least at that point. Love music for Hydras. And it's a fun one. You know, normally in games, I hate, I hate water levels. In this game, I think they're free. Yo, this one's freaking awesome. I love it. I do. I could play Hydro City all day. It's just really well designed. And again, the music for it is really nice. I definitely listened to the oscilloscope breakdown of it. What? No. Hey, what's up, Itachi? Oh, that's okay, you know. If you're not mature enough to handle the content, that's fine. You know, I'm not too particularly mature myself. <laughs> Oh, really? I do have it set for mature audiences only to cover myself every once in a while, you know, I swear. I really, I actually been trying really hard not to uh, swear anymore. I used to never, and then I started, started years ago. I was working with, like, truck drivers and, like, people who worked out and uh, they did, like, kind of production fabrication type of stuff and I mean like some of those guys like they just that's just how they are like the F the F word is you know it's like a, it's like an article it's like you know saying ah or the or something you know <laughs> it's just it's just a word they throw in everything and of course you know I picked that up and then because part of what I had to do was get along with those people to get them to cooperate with, with me. But, you know, then it was kind of one of those things that slowly over time, it just kind of caught on. I was like, ah, oh, crap, I'm in trouble now. And also, I don't know what anyone in the chat's going to say. And, you know, some of the games I was playing before, I mean, they had... You know, it wasn't cute and fuzzy like uh, you know, Sonic here. So, there was that, too. I had to be a little more careful and cover myself. Especially after I got affiliate there, because I don't want to get myself in trouble with Mama Twitch. I think... Oh, it's a dog. I... I might have messed myself up here. I don't know. Yeah, I did, actually. Cool. No, I didn't. We're good. Yeah, I decided... I, I really wanted to kind of go back to, like, some of the old-school Sonic games and play one of the ones that I really like. And so I broke out Sonic 3 and Knuckles, and of course I'm playing it as Sonic with Tails. But... I mean, I've been playing some 3D Sonic games, and I do appreciate some 3D Sonic but I'm always probably going to like these ones more.
I think gauntlets that it's pretty much you just you're in a dungeon right and you just kill a bunch of monsters and try to find the entrance to the next floor isn't it I think that's what gauntlet is the company's bankrupt oh my gosh What was it copyright stuff I was concerned about? It's just if there if there's a kid in the chat, right, and you you know certain things are going on in the chat, then you can get in trouble for it on Twitch. That's kind of. I just cover myself. I, I really kind of hate to do that because, like I said, I try to, especially when I've been playing lately, it's definitely kid friendly, but sometimes uh, what people say in the chat or what comes out of my mouth isn't. And, you know, I also don't want to have to worry about, I mean, not that I usually have a whole lot of people talking, but I don't have to worry about policing the chat or any of that stuff. It's kind of silly. Ooh, final emerald. Let's flipping go. If I get this, I can be supersonic. But, yeah, I don't know. Maybe things will change. I'll open up the channel for, you know, less mature audiences. But, like I said, then I have to kind of be more careful and then some of the stories I tell too I would yeah you know, I wouldn't be able to tell with the kids around which kind of sucks too so I don't know I gotta we're down to the last four I'm gonna be keeping an eye on this pretty close so if I don't see the chat I will look at it here shortly where are these last four I know you're hiding somewhere yes I thought I smelled some blue spheres it will That Nightbot, yeah, Nightbot is pretty nuts. I mean, I gotta be honest with you. You know, if 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 this were my platform and I could, you know, I didn't have to worry about any of that stuff. I'd just be like, you know what? Like, don't don't post porn or gore stuff, because honestly, uh, but I can't. I don't want that, and especially gory crap. I can't really look at. And uh, you know, don't don't be. I don't know. Making any. Uh, don't be planning your drug business stuff in here. You know. Other than that, I don't really care what you say. I really just at the end of the game. The end of the game. End of the day. Don't really like policing people's uh, speech. Yeah, it just makes my job harder too if I have to do that. But, you know, people can't kinda especially these days, kinda let that let anything go either. You know, everyone's trying to Censor or shut down somebody. And, uh, I just don't. I find it to be rather pointless. Oh, I took my rings. Not that it really matters, but. Alright, we got it. I know. The 
whatever the default chat moderation Twitch has, I've gotten in trouble with it a few times, like, and over, like, stupid stuff, too. Uh, yeah, what was it? Not yes. I don't think it was yesterday. Maybe it was yesterday. It was either that or the day before. I was watching somebody play Sonic CD because I never play that game. I don't particularly care for it, but, you know, I'm willing to, to watch somebody play it, maybe learn about it a little more. And we were talking about the, the soundtracks because that game, they made a whole different soundtrack for it for the market here in the U.S. Because for some reason they felt that the Japanese tracks wouldn't do as well. People wouldn't like them as much. Which I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I I thought the Japanese soundtrack was actually pretty solid. But either way. Either way. Ooh. Um, but of course, the, the Japanese soundtrack for the game... You know, it's abbreviated J-A-P, you know, Jap, for Japanese. And I put that in the chat, and the stupid bot just, like, pounced on that crap. So it did. I was like, ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> not this, not this garbage. And again, I mean, there wasn't anything offensive going on there. I think I glitched the game because there's just rocks falling, falling continuously for no actual reason. Wow, more, more rings. Sweet. Kind of wish I could be in super form without having to listen to the super music because I like the normal soundtrack. This gets old after about, like, an hour or two of listening to it. I might try to play without transforming. Just, to uh, do it. Because the music is half the experience. I don't need anything in here. I'm gonna just game over that one. Gutter ball it. So, Tachi, I, I already probably know the answer to this one, but did you watch the dev stream? Yeah, I kind of figured. They're talking about sockets. Like, they might do something kind of like the idea with, like, socket, socketed items or something, but it wasn't going to be sockets. I didn't watch a whole lot of it. I was actually really busy. I think when it first came on, I had a meeting for work I had to do, and it was, it was stupid, but... We had a meeting, nonetheless, and then after that we were just stupid busy, because hey, it's the end of the day, and it's Friday. So, you know, everybody wants stuff, because oh, oh my god, I piddled around for so long that I can't get, you know, still need to do whatever. So, yeah, that was fun. Those people are real awesome. But then I got off and I was like, you know what? Like I got all my video editing and stuff done. And I was like, you know. I don't normally stream Friday. I should keep a consistent schedule and just stick to it. But Ah, to hell with it. I'll, I'll stream, because I've got nothing else to do today, and I wanted to play one of these games, and, you know, sometimes people want to watch it.
People be afraid of me. They be afraid of me, I think. Sometimes. They see me playing Sonic and they're like, I don't know, man. That guy, his skill is pretty intimidating. I don't know if I can handle this. If you believe that, I might have a bridge to sell you. The shade. Yeah, yeah, you know what? Uh, you might end the fedora. See, I, I decided I wanted to, you know, maybe not look so tough. So, I mean, you can't really see it that well, but, like, you know, I changed it up a bit. I got, I got my lab coat on instead of my, my trench coat, you know? Now I look like the, uh, you know, partially like the friendly neighborhood doctor. You know, that or the guy who's gonna amputate your arm. I don't know. Uh, probably. Oh my gosh, how do I keep landing on that? Okay, you darn thing. But yeah, you know, it is what it is. It's also kind of early. Really, if I was central time or mountain time, I think it would be more ideal for me because there's more people around to watch. Takes takes the other folks a little bit longer to get up and around and about on Twitch. But hey, it is what it is. I don't really care. Even if nobody stops by, I'm playing a game I like to play anyway. So I don't care if anyone's watching me or not, because I'd be playing it regardless. And that's just kind of how I do things. I don't force myself to play anything. If I think the game sucks, I ain't touching it. Speaking of sucky games, though... I ended up getting myself Sonic Frontiers, and it is a very mixed uh, reviews on Steam. And probably rightfully so, if I'm being honest, but still kind of interesting that it is. It's definitely very different from I think pretty much any other Sonic game, but I'm gonna give it a try. It was on sale, and I want to play through all the Sonic games on PC at some point anyway, so it was already on my radar. I don't know, I'll check it out. Probably start playing that next week. Either that or Sonic Forces. I don't think. I don't know. Forces wasn't particularly super uh, popular either, really, but. I thought it was alright. Kind of liked how the story was darker. Granted, you know, the writing and stuff maybe could have been a bit better. But, you know, it is what it is. At least uh, I didn't have to watch a human girl kiss Sonic, you know, again, so. Had a book sale. Oh, wow, 11 books. That's not too bad. You do a lot of reading? I'm guessing?
I like how you can hit him infinite times, but until you get into the air, you can't actually defeat him. Because reasons. Yeah, I would say so. That's quite a deal. What did you pick up? Anything good? Love this. So much better than the crappy music that they made for this level originally. As simple as some of the music is for the Michael Jackson team that they made, I must say, it sounds better than the prototype music they had. Can I? There we go. Oh, Whatever. Gotcha. All right. You need something entertaining to do while you uh, you play Last Epoch, right? same time just I can't get the, I can't work up the motivation to, to play it lately it's so hard to okay that's one of those times where the game squishes you just because reasons wow I didn't even get a checkpoint so I gotta start all the way at the beginning wow why not kick me in the crotch too while you're at it jeez Well, I mean, you do better than me. I... I mean, like, I can read, but I I totally did that to myself. This is where, I, this is where I'm going to start to do absolutely rubbish today. Apparently. This is the beginning of the end for me. Bounce. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. To sit still and read, I just have a hard time making myself do that. Like, I gotta be... I gotta be physically moving is the problem. Like, for me to be entertained, I have to be physically moving. And I don't mean, like, you know, moving my eyes left and right or... Um... What the heck? That was weird. Or turning a page, like, I gotta be moving. Like, a lot of times when I watch movies or shows or something, I'm on my mini trampoline jumping. I just cannot sit still. It's actually, sometimes it's kind of hard for me even streaming. Because normally, again, I, I'd be, like, jumping on my mini trampoline or something when I'm doing this, but... You know, you'd be able to tell I was bouncing or something. 
if I were doing that, and then, you know, it's gonna look kind of funny with me just kind of jumping up and down playing a Sonic game. Like, I'm, all, I'm weird enough. I don't need to raise cause for alarm, you know? <laughs> but... This thing's not working! Oh my god, it's broke! There we go. This is where I died, that one. No, this isn't where I died, it was the Spikeronis. I think I got past them. Hey, it's a checkpoint. Yeah, come on. Well, I know some people do read to help them fall asleep. It's not a uh, terrible thing to do. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of, I knew what you meant there. I didn't think you were having Mardi Gras early at your, uh, your home. But. Uh-oh. I think there's a... Oh, gosh darn it. You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna drown if I'm not careful. No! The spike squished me. I bet it is hard. See, what I should do sometime is have, like, a, a Discord chat thing while I, while I play. That way, like, if you and Ocean want to hang around, I can just talk. I walked in it, what, 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 ah, ah! Word, sentences, and phrases. game only did that because I'm blue. Oh no, I didn't get the ring of the dig. I screwed up. I think this put me back at the beginning also. Yeah, I hosed that one. Ooh, I almost touched spikes there. That could have been bad. The only, the only. Pr that timing on those spikes, they always get me. I forget they're there. And I walk right up to them and they're like, squish. See, when I roll, they don't come out. But if I just ran like normal, they would have gotten me perfectly. This game's rigged. It's rigged. It cheats. Change my mind. The game cheats. Change my mind. watched a guy um, there's a there's a dude I follow on Twitch he's kind of cool you know I, he when he plays Sonic Origins I'll tune into his stream 
But he got on yesterday, and man, that guy had, like... He just had bad luck. So he did. He had some real bad luck. And he kept dying. And he ended up just kind of saying to heck with it. And he just, he just kind of rage quit. I'm like, dang, dude. I mean, I've, I've eaten some dirt in these games too. And I even kind of know what I'm doing. But I didn't do that. I should have dedicated my stream to him in in honor or no in memory of uh <laughs> Oh my gosh. We don't wanna hit the balloons, those slow me down. Oh my god. No, I can't No, stop bouncing me! There we go. When it behaves, it works so much better. Oh, really? See, now I jump so high that it's kind of working against me now. I just want to get to the egg graviton. Oh, nice! I got stuff and things there. Take that. Oh, we got more rings. Switch. Okay, I have to spin under that because it has a tendency to squish me for no reason. Sometimes you can't beat the original. Oh, the Barrel of Doom. As it's rightfully called. I remember being stuck on that thing when I was a kid. Man, those, like, this version of the game, those have a really hard time. I don't understand why. I get a oh it's one of these things. Shoot. Oh come on. I guess that's that's all she wrote for that little thing there. Is this the end? No. Ooh, ooh, I wanted that. Good thing I have tails. I can't believe you deleted your sorcerer though, and then you made a rogue Itachi. Like, I don't know. I think I, I don't think you're the real Itachi. I think the aliens kidnapped you and they replaced you with a clone that they made in their spaceship. That's what I think happened. Here we go, boss time. Yeah, I beat him as fast as a speedrunner, except I didn't have to put nearly as much effort. The road propaganda. Oh, that's what happened. You got brainwashed. Damn, dude. My 
understanding is that, at least in the prototype version of this game, Flying Battery Zone was supposed to be in between this and the last zone. But things changed, and here we are. Boarding down a mountain. Bam! And then you crash into a wall. And get buried by snow! The breakdown of Ice Cap Zone is really cool. Hey, Tails grabbed the thingy. Fire shield, I don't know if that's gonna be particularly helpful, but it's not gonna hurt you. Again, all those rings. Yeah, let's just need to add a little. So I just need three more. There, I got another life. And there's more rings. Jeez, I have, I have so many rings. It tried to squash me. I think that one goes up when you step on it. This is what I need right here, this lightning shield. Bam. I'm gonna have to actually get some speed here. my rings. I have a lot. Oh god, this thing. Oh gosh, I almost went the wrong direction and got squished there. That could have been very terrible for me. Yeah, let's go to the bonus. No, it's the one I don't like. It's the one I don't like. Abort! Abort the mission! Ah. Uh, that one I can get the Robotniks on the slots and lose everything that I have. Including my home. Now it's kind of funny. Supersonic in this game has green eyes. I just got done with Sonic Adventure, and I think they gave him red eyes. Hey, thanks for the sub, Mr. Conflux. You should be able to use my emote now, too, since you did that. It's a pretty cool emote, if I do say so myself. Totally not saying that because I'd be biased in any way toward my own emote. Now he's not a Super Saiyan, Hedgehog. Who knows, maybe he'll have blue eyes in the game sometime. He could be the blue eyes white hedgehog. You know, let's take the upper path. I wanna I wanna go high. Oh my god, I messed that up. My timing was trash. The reflexes of a 90-year-old man. 
Way back in my day, we had one life and you had to beat the game. There was no continues either. I know in, uh, I think it was the first Donkey Kong Country game. Uh, what's the, shoot, I can't remember what the old, the old man is called. Crap. Yeah, I can't remember what his name is now. But he had a line something like that in the game. So, another life that I don't actually need, but uh, there it is. Okay, I hosed that, and we're almost at the end. I'm gonna go ahead and transform. Shoot! Oh, that's right, I gotta press. I'm being dumb. I'm doing the dumb thing. Oh my gosh. You know what? This is why I have Tails. He makes up for my mistakes. Why? Because Tails is awesome, that's why. Too bad I don't have a lightning shield there, but we'll be fine. It's time for a boss. Uh-oh. I'm gonna hit this switch. Oh, that's right, Cranky. I, you know, it's been so long since I've played any Donkey Kong games. I just, but I can remember the ones from like Donkey Kong 64, at least the ones you played as. And I remember Funky Kong. Funky Kong was kind of crazy. Then there was, I don't know, was it Candy Kong? It's like Donkey Kong's girlfriend. some of the you know like Donkey Kong or Mario or some of that stuff here on Twitch but like I said I've just been playing stuff that I can actually play on the computer without an emulator but you know Nintendo doesn't port their stuff to PC which you know I mean, whatever I guess that's that's their decision. They they want to repackage it and sell it on their next console when it comes out because that's kind of what they do. They just recycle IP anymore. It's not to say they don't come out with anything new, but they'll be like, hey, you know, for the umpteenth time, you can buy the original Mario game, but it's on this platform now. And if you own it for a previous platform, well, get wrecked because you gotta buy it again. So I'm happy Sega's like, yeah, we'll send Sonic over to PC eventually. At least a lot of them. Especially now that so many people have kind of quit doing the whole console thing, I think it's a wise decision. You know, back when PC gaming wasn't such a big thing, and you know, everyone was kind of spread out across PlayStation and Xbox and whatever Nintendo was, you know, trying to sell at the time. Yeah, I could kind of understand. Oh shoot! I love that. Thing. Oh, do I have to like? Yeah, I have to go off screen so it resets. Oh no, never mind. It was in the ground, and I. Yeah. Bam! If he 
get that timing right, I'm telling you, that little, that little extra move there you can do while you're in the air is pretty darn nice. I don't want to go this way. This is mirror mode, gosh darn it. We're playing the game backward. It's playing the game left to right is overrated. He wasn't called Cranky Kong yet? Okay. I can't remember. I almost beat the original Donkey Kong Country game. I got stuck on, I think it was called Tanked Up Trouble. And I ended up game overing there, and that was it. And I was actually pretty annoyed, and I never played it again. I think, oh, you know what? No, what ha Yeah, that happened, but also I lost my save. That was the other thing, and that's why I never played it again. Look at Tails grabbing his ring ones for me. What a, what a bro. Tails is so useful. Except for when he's not. And when he's not useful, he's usually getting you killed. Which is pretty much the opposite of being useful. Hey, it's Robot Nick. Uh-oh. I don't like what you're doing, Knuckles. He just threw a bomb in the building and now it's collapsing. All because he wanted to stop Sonic. It's kind of extreme. up for video game trivia stuff. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I still remember that cheesy DK rap from Donkey Kong 64. And as a kid, like, they're talking about, uh, which one was it? Oh, shoot. Actually, I can't remember what his name is. It's the one that's kind of big like Donkey Kong, but it's not Donkey Kong. Oh, no, I can't remember. If I, if I saw it or heard it, I'd be like, oh yeah, that's it. I can't think of it at the moment. Tails, get off of that. Bruh. Pick me up before you go-go. I can't remember what his name is now. But either way, like, part of the rap is, you know, he's one hell of a guy. Yeah, he may move slow, he can't jump high, but this Kong's one hell of a guy. And I was like, oh man, I can't believe they used the word hell in a Nintendo game. <laughs> Completely caught me off guard. Because I think even in Smash Brothers, they changed it to heck of a guy. When they had their version of the DK rap for one of the levels. And I was like, wow, that's kind of dumb, but they've tried to change a lot of things with Smash Brothers there to... I don't know. I don't necessarily like it, but it is what it is. 
Smash Bros. used to be a game that I enjoyed. It's not anymore. But that's fine. A bunch of other people still enjoy it. Them changing it to something that I don't particularly like just saves me a bunch of money. Especially considering now that game is just like a huge DLC cash grab. We came out with a new character, new, you know, customization stuff for your custom character. Yeah. So, pay lots and lots of money for it. Oh, we added a new level. Give us your money for that, too. It's Swanky Kong? Okay. Actually, all this Donkey Kong talk, it reminds me of that, that joke thing. Um, it was... Uh, Jeopardy? They, were at, they asked some kind of question, and they, it was supposed to be like... I think Sonic was the... Sonic the, the answer to it? I can't remember. That or it was Donkey Kong, but either way... Um... Yeah, they, they modified it, and they changed it to Danky Kang. It's Danky Kang! And then, like, every everybody started making a meme out of it. And they had, like, a blue Donkey Kong that had the intro thing that Sonic has. And I don't know, it was pretty ridiculous, honestly, but it was pretty funny. I enjoyed the stupid BSery there. Scooby Doo family. Yes, everybody's name ends with. It's like Doo is their last. Well, Doo is their last name, I guess. Scooby Doo at Nintendo. Oh, wow, I just kind of jumped up there. I didn't know I could do that. I know they had Scooby-Doo and they had Scrappy-Doo. I don't know of any other Doos, though. I only really watch, like, the old, old, uh, Scooby-Doo cartoons. I grew up on those. I actually really loved those as a kid. Da-da-doo. What the heck? Mumsy-doo. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Of course. Of course. Yeah, I don't know. I like the old, old, old Scooby-Doo stuff. The old Hanna-Barbera cartoons. I... I don't know. I don't... Never really watched the, the newer stuff. Maybe some of it's okay, I don't know. Skippy-doo. Yeah, but do howdy-do. What the heck? It's howdy-do, D-time. Oh, I jumped right into his hand like a dummy. Good thing I'm supersonic and he can't touch me. There we go. I have a new, like, kind of trick thing. Can I... Oh, come on. I just want to kill you. There we go. I was trying, like, some new stuff there. Or at least stuff I don't usually try. I know Scrappy-Doo, because he was in the old Scooby-Doo cartoons. Oh, 
Those Robotnik is flying toward the death egg. Scooby Dumb, of course. They had a lot of fun with those names. Oh no, I gotta collect all the new emeralds now since we're in the second half of the game. I love that theme. I know I've seen things they said it it's supposed to be like Blood on the Dance Floor by Michael Jackson. Oh god. Is that like an older thing or is that like a newer thing? Because I feel like they wouldn't get away with it these days with how everybody is about stuff. Like, someone would find a reason to complain and, you know, write to the editor about it, or protest it, or burn something. Yeah, I'm I don't I don't recall that one, but yeah, I'm not surprised that is that is older. I don't know, sometimes I wish I could just go back to the nineties. You know, I had Sonic the Hedgehog, I had Scooby Doo and you know bunch of good stuff. The world wasn't, you know, as uh, completely out of its mind as it is now. You know, we had Pokemon even, damn it. We had Pokemon before it was popular. It sounds like they definitely had a lot of fun with that character. Yeah, well, I mean, they used to have fun little, you know, jokes and stuff like that. But, yeah, they'd never, never be able to do that these days. Uh -huh. As people be shunned from society. Shunned! Okay, I think I went past a bonus raid. Pretty sure I did. Well, actually, you know what? It might not be. That's just where that little pump... Pumperoni comes up. Nah, that's... Yeah, that's not. I didn't miss it. I don't remember exactly where these things are, but I know roughly where they are. A skeletal dog. Oh my. Scooby dead? <laughs> I mean... Yeah, he's down there. That's where this homie is. And then I gotta go down for the next one. Actually, down for the next two. Oh no, I don't wanna do that! No! I'm so stupid. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I always forget if I walk back on it, it takes you out of the, the thing. Oh. 
Well, I mean, it'll just take me a little bit longer to get all the rings. That, or emeralds, that's fine. Gosh darn it, Bobby. What'd you do that for? Now I gotta remember how to do this in reverse. This might take me a couple of tries. This one's a little bit different. I think the last time I attempted this, I screwed it up a couple of times. Oh, I got it! Sweet! The Pilgrims? Is that what you're talking about? The Pilgrims? Come on, Mr. Book Reader. I'm just joking. Oh, man. Should be another bonus ring right around the corner. Oh, you, you dippity doo -dah. Might as well take out those butcher fats. They're butterflies, but they're not made out of butter. Why are they butterflies? Nasty do. Dang. You say, and they had some dysfunction in your family, Itachi? Is that, is that what I'm picking up here? They had nasty do. I guess every every family's got to have that one uncle that's a uh, SOB, right? Oh my god! And there we go. We got another emerald. I still can't believe I I screwed up that one. Ugh. A sleazy car salesman. Okay. Gotta love those. Who doesn't like... Did he have, like, the... I don't know. Did they give him, like, slicked back hair? Because, like, that's... You gotta have that with a sleazy car salesman. stuff. Ah, oh, crap. I didn't get the last one. That's okay. Just a werewolf. So he had a werewolf uncle. Mushroom Hill Zone. Now, of course, I say that, but I just got rid of it momentarily, but you know, take my word for it, it's good. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm trying to remember where all these thingies are. 
Wow, I really went flying there. Holy Sleetos. Alright, we're just gonna go straight up, do the what would have been the first one in the original game. Yeah, I don't know. I might... There's either... I want to say there's four or five of these in this zone. So if I hit them all, I can get the emeralds. But you know what? If I don't get them, it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. There won't be any uh, chaos unfolding. And we'll get it eventually. It just means I get to listen to the original soundtrack longer without the temptation of always going super... I really need to find a mod that turns off the super music. And then I can have the best of all worlds. Alright, where's these last 13 blue balls at? That I need to get. Well, there's nine of them. Alright, there's four, so it's like a it's like a plus sign somewhere that I missed. Like those ones right there. Actually, is there a oh there is. I bet you yeah. Uh-huh. There we go. There they are. Clown dog. Man, they, they like really expanded um, Scooby-Doo's family from the sound of it. That's nuts. Okay, so I did this. I think I want to go down now? Oh, come on. Nice. Don't do that. Don't do stupid things. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes, as they say. I don't think there is a... Oh, this is... Okay, I know where this is. Relatively speaking. I really like the percussion in this. I'm trying to remember if I need to go up or not. No, this is where I go up. I smell a bonus ring. Gosh darn it, Blobby. See, I knew there was one here. I only need two more. I know there's one at the very, very end. And there's at least one in between here and there. So if I can find it, It'll be smooth sailing. It's funny because I mean, I play this this game. I played it quite a bit in the past and everything, but like I never. It's like the track, the path to take. It's not been like hardwired into my brain yet. I just kind of like I don't memorize stuff. I just kind of get the strong hunch, like sort of where to go. We got the purple emerald. That's what I'm talking about. Maybe that's what I ought to do, Tachi. If I don't, uh, if I don't make it as a as a Twitch streamer here, maybe I'll join the circus. I think I'd look good with a curly wig and a bright red nose. What do you think? I think I could rock the look. I could stuff myself into a car with like a bunch of other clowns. You know, actually, now that I think about this, this sounds like a terrible idea. No, the butterfly touched me. 
I did not consent to that. Oh god, why? Okay, so we're here. No. I'm trying to think how I need to go about proceeding here. I think that is the route that I have to go. I don't think there's actually an option. Somewhere there's a ring. Bonus ring hit. Hidden. This goes around. Yeah, that just. Duh, I just came from that. I'm not very good with the directions and maps. That's what I think. I'd be bad at these things. I might not get what I'm looking for at this rate. Yeah, because this is the very last bonus ring in the level. Again, I mean, you know, if I don't get them all now, it's not the end of the world. I'll find another one. Probably find Flying Battery Zone or one of the other ones. I can always get it in Sandobolus, too. It's not, not the end of the world. Oh, this is one of the ones... Actually, this one's not too bad. I take that back. This one's kind of easy. But now that I said that, I'll probably mess it up. About how my luck goes. It's like, oh, it's easy, you say. Well, then. Hold my beer and watch this. All right, another emerald down. Ooh, that's my favorite one. It's a blue one. Kind of sad that the super emeralds never showed up again, but then again, that's a lot of collectible stuff. That emerald did not look blue. I'm sorry, it did not look like the one that I just got. Uh, I guess here's the question. Do I want to go back and try to... Oh, come on. Ice, why are you so bad? How did it, like, not... He didn't get the speed he should have. Forget, there's something up here. Oh. I lost Tails! Tails, I need- Oh gosh darn it. Apparently, somehow, yeah. Gosh darn it, Tails! Oh my god, this is gonna be a poop show. I guess you just land up here and then you just kind of okay that's how that works i never knew that could have gone my whole life without knowing that but okay but you know if you don't explore you don't get to learn all the cool stuff Yeah. <laughs> 
kind of crazy we're at this part of the game already because I don't... I don't know how long has this stream been going. I just don't feel like I've been streaming all that long today. I guess, well, shoot, we're almost two hours in. Dang. It does not feel like two hours. Every time there's an item I want, that stupid thing puts one of those black bubbles. Yeah, it just does not. Oh my god, Tails, why are you sabotaging me? Whose side are you on? Whose side are you on, I tell you what? Yeah. I think it's called the Egg Scrambler. I don't know why. It doesn't scramble you, but whatever. Oh, you know what? Because it scrambles the, the radio signal thing. It's like a jammer. I got it now. I got it now. Now we get a flying battery zone. That's a big crowd favorite. But yeah, we're making we're making some progress here. Oh, there was a glitch there I wanted to try. I completely forgot. Yeah, whatever. I always forget about these things until it's too late. I also don't know if it actually works in a screen. Might not. I don't know what's going on. There's like people yelling out. So. Usually pretty quiet around. Out in the middle of nowhere, Bill. shield is definitely nice to have here. Cause there's enough fire. Oh god. Oh wow, I don't remember this firing so quickly. But it didn't hit me. Yes, I don't Wow, I suck. Alright. At least I got the life I don't need. See if I can get a shield. This one's a mobility. All it is. Yeah, actually, fire shield would be very nice. Come on, game. Fire shield. Oh, yeah, uh, uh. There we go. He picked up a repair. You know what I normally go up? Let's go down this time. Actually, I think this is the path most people take. I'm not even sure they're aware that there is another one. Well, at least most people play in this. Just like we can go up here. Oh, I bet I can get a ring here. Bonus ring. We might get that last emerald. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's get hypersonic. 
Ooh, this one might be tough. This guy might be tough, not gonna lie. I've been known to screw it up. If you don't go the right way, you get burned. I hear the woodpeckers outside squawking at each other. Almost sounds like a squeaky toy, kind of. Like you give a dog or something. They're cool though, as long as they don't, you know, start putting holes in my shed again this year. Definitely don't necessarily appreciate that one. Bam! There we go. We got all the emeralds. Every, every single emerald. We just got them. We just got them. <laughs> Let's go. I kind of wish Sega could make a Sonic game that I enjoyed as much as this one. I don't know, I don't think they really want to do a lot of... Oh, there's another thing here! I'll be darned! I don't know, I think they want to do the whole 3D Sonic thing. I think these days, probably most people want the 3D. I'll take both. Either or is fine with me. But I want something like this. Alright, let's do it. The boss that hits himself. Painting yourself. And now I just, I just, you know, I don't even touch it. I can beat this without even touching the game. I'm that good. Ooh. I can play this game with no hands, Mom. And it's over. No, I didn't <coughs> get to move it where I wanted. Oh well. See, some people don't like that high-pitched uh, instrument there. I actually think it sounds pretty cool. But I was watching a, a thing where they broke down the music for this, and there were a few people that were like, Man, I don't like that high-pitched instrument they used in this song. What the heck? And someone's like, I don't know, maybe the person who composed it you know, regretted doing it later, and they realized they messed up. But I'm like, I like it. I like that little thing. Maybe that's just me. You only hear it, like, for a little bit of the song anyway. I can't imagine. It also makes it feel very different. Because you're in the second you're in the second zone. Like, come on, man. To what it's worth, I agree with the uh, the composer's choice there. I'm 
not really sure what that thing is supposed to be, but there's a lot of them. Oh, you know what? I almost... Yeah, I had a feeling there was going to be a thing here. To a degree, too, they kind of got like the 007 thing going on with this song, too. Which, I honestly, like... I thought before there was a little hint of it, but they definitely, uh, they definitely did put it in there. There's a word for it, I don't know what it is, it's some kind of fancy magic term. I'm no composer or music expert. I just know what I like to listen to. Golden Green Sonic. Yeah, as a Packers fan. <laughs> yes. Don't you know, Sonic likes them Packers. That's great. Ooh. That could have gone very badly for me. I realized that afterwards. Come on! There we go. I think we're at the end here. Yep, this is... It's the end of... I don't know if you could actually beat that in the original game. Either way, we just knocked that bad boy out. Come on, Sonic, move! And now we wait. Now we wait. One guy I watched do boss runs, he just like... He tries to like tap the... the the D-pad so you can just like make Sonic walk in place. And I like him, I'm not gonna spin dash on it and get hit. I'm just gonna beat the snot out of old Roboto. Tails, why are you screwing me up? Come on, homie. Why you gotta be like that? Why you gotta be so cruel? Oh boy! I don't like this zone at all! The music's not bad, but I don't like the zone, all the same. Because you got things like that. And they will ruin your day. The bass for this is nuts, though. <laughs> Why did he go fly? Oh, he's got that stupid uh, drop dash thing. I don't... Personally, I don't like that. Some people really like the drop dash. I don't. It's not my preference ever. But hey, each their own. I just had to be careful not to activate that by accident and get myself in trouble. Bam! Oh, I missed. Ooh, 
my favorite bonus, the glowing spears. Let's go. Alright, lightning shield. That's definitely better than the old bubble. It's actually kind of funny. I adjusted pretty quick. Yes. Oh my god. Like, this, this homie here. Yes, we know you're in town. Congratulations. Like, we, we all know you're here. Thank you. Thank you for, like, revving your engine and screeching your tires on the road. Let me... Uh, we'll send you a medal in the mail. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Damn kids in there! Loud vehicles, I tell you what! I don't know. I think I'd make a pretty good grumpy old man. I think I think it would actually fit me pretty well. You know, when I when I'm old. I think I'd enjoy it. I can channel that that old that grumpy old man energy. We're going straight down. <laughs> Back in my day, we paid 99 cents for a car. He also got paid a penny at the end of the week. A gold penny. I don't even know if that exists. That's okay, the kids wouldn't know any better anyway. They weren't alive back then. Oh, this is the one I have to jump on. Of course. What I really don't like is the pyramid coming up. Like, it's kind of cool, but it's just annoying to traverse. Oh, those things. We just springboarded off of those spikes and went hypersonic. What a complete turnaround of events. That's, that's definitely making the lemonade out of the lemon. Although lemons are actually good for you, lemonade is not, so I don't know if that's a that's a good saying or not. One set of one cent it could be worth two. Well you know, that inflation. Over the years. Come get me, brah. The hardest boss in the game after the dude hits himself. He's. I don't want to try something. He did. He jumped in after me, so you don't even have to knock him in. You just make him chase you. Because he's a crazy whatever he is. At least I got a fire shield. That'll help me out.
Yeah, the wheat pennies. I know we used to have a bunch of those. My grandparents really got a boner over them. Okay, as long as I don't release the ghosts and I'm okay with everything being purple. Obviously, the cult from last epoch took over this world, too. See, they're interdimensional. They went to Sonic's world and they turned everything purple. Oh no, I turned- I just freed the ghosts. Gosh darn it. Ooh. This is why I'm afraid of the dark. Yeah. Hey! We got some of them ring-a-ding-dings. Um, actually- no, come on. Mm, come on, Sonic! Sonic. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna... We gotta go this... You gotta, like, spam that jump button. Like, your life depends on it. and stuff in the background are kind of cool and what they did with the flames is kind of cool too no i oh i just got so screwed over gosh darn it blobby i mean hypersonic can just kind of cheat honestly so like, I'm not dealing with this garbage anymore. Is that a bat? I think that was a bat. Oh my god. What? Ah, I got squished. Gosh darn it. I guess, uh, we're back here now. Hey, Mr. Ghosty. Now I have to do this legit. Oh, that sucked. Pretty badly, honestly. Tails just trying to balance on top of the thing because you know, Tails is goofy. I don't think I ever got squished in that one spot before. That's the thing, like, this version of the game, I mean, it, I'm glad we have it, but at the same time, they made it too easy to get squished. Come on. I could have just used Tails to do this, but we are technically on a timer. Tails, you just, you suck. Get away from me. You didn't help me. Not help. Yeah, definitely no help. deal with oh thank you tails for grabbing that light switch I was about to have phasmophobia ah tails why are you getting stabbed buddy Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, it doesn't squish you. Sweet. Oh my gosh. Really? That just happened. That actually happened. 
I would have been better off just, you know, doing the sand thing. But no, I had to be special. I don't even know how I didn't make that deal. It's rigged, I tell ya. It's rigged. Okay, I didn't think it was gonna actually let me grab onto that, so I just went ahead and pulled it. You know, we're at the boss, it doesn't matter. No, we're not at the boss, I lied. Oh my gosh, we're so far from the boss. Ugh. Making me sad. This is a game. This is an endless loop thing. I'm not supposed to... That's right. What the heck? I guess they want me to go this way? I don't... I don't even know anymore. It's like... It all takes me... I cannot control something. It's too quick. I'm gonna run out of rings here. Probably end up dead. Oh, why did I do that? Is this where I go? Yes, this is where I go. Alright, cool. Man, what a confusing level. Oh my god, whatever. I'll do this. Not that I really have much of it. In the matter. I need a light switch. These ghosts are about to get big and angry at me. I don't really want to do that. Oh my gosh. Alright, whatever. Oh my. Ugh. At least I know which way I need to go here. This is why it's easier just playing as Tails, because then you just control Tails. Fly wherever you want to go without any extra crap. On the bright side, we've got the rings for Hypersonic. Yeah, we are definitely gonna go hypersonic on this boss. Yeah, he didn't even stand a chance. Looks like we're going to Lava Reef. Love this. This is my favorite zone. Alright. We're going to take a short break here. But I will be right back. Uh, let's see.
All right, and we are back. Just had to get up and stretch the legs a little bit, man. Like, I was getting cramped real bad. My body does not like sitting still for a long time. Ooh, I gotta shut the window here. I'm starting to get bugs coming. I listened to the deconstructions of this level's music and and the second act. Pretty cool, honestly. I think so. Yeah, you're you're one of those rare kinds of Tachi. You do both jobs at the same time. I don't know how you pull it off. It must require a lot of hard work and dedication. I was kind of disappointed. I was hoping somebody would pop in here though and try to roast me. I don't know. Twitch just isn't edgy enough, I guess. Actually, I mean, really a quiet day for the most part. Yeah, true enough. See, this is why I don't invite people to roast me when I play Last Epoch, because then there's plenty of... Plenty of stuff to use there. I thought about like trolling and uh, just do really poorly. When I have the uh, the roast me tag going, and then when somebody says something, just kind of like pull out my mad skills. My, my mad skills. My angry. Ooh, this path I don't normally take. I forgot it existed. They can give me this bonus level every time, and I'll never be unhappy about it. Let's take that fire shield. Fire shield's very good in lava levels. Who'd have thought, right? Oh, I gotta go up higher. No, don't give me the water shield. Ooh, that was... Ah. Oh! They're trying to, they're trying to sabotage me there. I had to, I had to just get the heck out of that. They gave me two water shield power-ups in a row. I was like, this ain't what I want. Ain't what I want. Oh, I know. I gotta hit this little button here. That's okay, we're at the boss anyway, so. All right, it's Mr. Handyman.
That's never happened to me, I swear. <laughs> I don't know. At least I'm not having the night that the other guy had. I, I don't know if you were here when I was talking about it, but there's a guy I actually watch on Twitch every once in a while when he's playing this game specifically, because he plays, like, Fortnite and stuff. I'm not... I don't know. I'm not into those. But anyway... Um... But... That's where Knuckles goes. Unfortunately, we can't go there without cheating. But... Yeah, he was... He was playing, like, the first Sonic game, I think. And he just did not have luck. He was getting crushed. So I think like, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes into his stream, he rage quit and, I don't know, he started playing Rocket League. I was like, well, I guess Sonic's over, I'm out of here. It's kind of like that, um, I don't know, have you ever watched the movie McClintock? It's got John Wayne in it. Yeah, so anyway, there's a there's a scene like at the end of the game. There's some kind of party celebration thing going on in the, the Indians. You know, as they refer to them. Uh, somebody kind of sympathizes with them and knows they've been getting a, a raw deal. And so they give them like a bunch of guns and stuff so they can kind of just go and raise heck. And so what happens is at the end of the the movie, they get the guns, and they just kind of ride through town shooting in the air. They're not actually trying to kill anybody. They're just, you know, raising hell. And they're all, like, a bunch of old old fogies, too, right? Like, they're... They don't give a shit. And, um... So... <clears throat> the celebration's going on, and... The... They kind of, they settle down and everything, and they join the, the party. And I forget what started it, but, yeah, of course, there ends up being a fist fight. <laughs> but, yeah, there ended up being a fist fight, and the, the Indians, they're just kind of like, they're chilling there. And they're drinking like all the all the alcohol and shit, cause that's that's why they're there. They they wanted to get drunk, and they they end up drinking the rest of it while everyone else is fighting. So the the chief the chief is like kind of up there on top of the hill, and he's like, "No more whiskey. We go home." And then like they go to leave. <laughs> and they just let everybody else finish beating the crap out of each other. It's pretty funny. I don't know, I just, sometimes, like, I'll remember that scene. No whiskey, we go home. They just wanted to go get their drink on, that's it. I'm not gonna say it's like the best John Wayne movie ever, but it is alright. It had some funny moments. But these days, it'd drive people crazy, probably. They'd lose their minds over it. 
Which is funny to me, because I grew up on the on Western movies. Just old movies and stuff in general. Definitely a lot of old John Wayne stuff. <laughs> I don't think so. Unless he just so happened to have a, you know, brother or something named Bruce. Or cousin, I guess. I don't know. It would explain why Batman is such a badass, though. He just runs in the family, right? John Wayne was always getting into gunfights and fistfights with people. This is the last hit he needs. No, this one is. Yeah, there we go. Hey! Oh, we did it! It's all downhill from here. We got, we got through most of this game. We've got three zones left and some bosses and then that's it anytime I play this game it's always a longer stream this is probably gonna be at least three hours by the time we're done it might even be a little bit over I've been kind of just lollygagging here not really trying to get through it particularly fast Oh, I hate this bonus level. Get me out of here. I don't know if there's stuff and things up here I can grab or not. Doesn't look that way. Oh. Well, you know what? I'll fight. I'll fight Knuckles without super form. It's okay. You think he'd learn? I got that timing down for that little temporary shield attack thing. I almost never get to use it, but I got that timing down. I should try some boss runs. Because that's like the key to doing the Masonic. <laughs> You can't actually beat him, unfortunately. He has, like, infinite hit points. Actually, no, you can beat him. He he takes 200, at least in the old game. I think I saw a video, it takes 250 hits to defeat that, and then it, like, breaks the game. It's funny, because they made a reference to that scene in Sonic Mania where Knuckles remembers what happens and he's just like, yeah, I'm not doing that again. Sonic Mania is a good game. I still like this. I still like the old Genesis games more, though. There's the Death Egg, and there's all the robots he's sending out of it. <laughs> I like the music for this level, too. Again, after kind of watching the... I didn't see the decomp video for this one, but I did see the music theory one for this. And I 
had a whole brand new appreciation for it. I don't know how many jobs there are or people are looking for music composers, but it seems like it could be a pretty interesting job. But then again, I don't know, maybe it, you know, you kind of do it and then like it just gets boring and it's probably a lot of the same-ish stuff. I don't know, I guess it depends. If it's what you like, you, you don't have any trouble or whatever. Come on, Metal Sonic, you're gonna have to do better than that. You're doing bad. Tails even got a hit on him. In his version of the game, his, his AI, if you want to call it that, his scripting, perhaps, is a better way of putting it, is a lot better than it was. I hate this bonus stage. Quit giving it to me. Gosh darn it, the heck. Exactly. Dude, I love those emojis. They're so awesome. I'm proud of myself for making those. Although it wasn't entirely by scratch per se. There's like a website you can go to where it will take an image and add like animation stuff to it. But still, pretty cool. Oh, that reminds me, I have subscriber badges too that I've never implemented. I'm so dumb. I need to do that. What the heck? Is that like a dog with a police hat or something? Oh my gosh, quit giving me this bonus stage. I was getting lucky and not getting it at all, and now it's the only one that I get. It's a terrible one. And a club, nice. Wait a second, I... I done goofed. I went the wrong direction. What I think is funny is in Sonic Generations, they made Sky Sanctuary so annoying. Oh, there's a thing there that doesn't actually do me any good, but hey, it's there. I learned something today. No, I fell all the way- Ah, poop. You know what? Actually, I can- Oh, you know what? I probably can't do that. I actually can. Yeah, you can. You can boost up. Interesting. So I overshot, and what happened was, gosh darn it! Mm, you think I'd learn that the last time? I just gotta actually be patient. If I wasn't super, I'd just have tails fly me up. But every time I double tap A, he does his little flash attack that sends him moving super quick. Alright, got it! I can't do this. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have... I think that's the boss. I think that's the final boss fight for this level too. I'm gonna have no rings for it. I am gonna die. I'm gonna be a dead man. No, actually, this it's not here yet. I have I have a little bit of time. I'm still gonna lose my super form and be ringless. I probably should just let it tick down and end. But yeah, here we go. I'm I'm so uh, so well here. I'll have to do this the hard way.
Is that it? Yeah, I did it. Cool. No rings challenge, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Doritos. I don't... One thing sugar. I don't know what the other two are. Is that like a pizza slice or a piece of cheese with a face on it? And then I can't... Okay. Okay. Stinky. It does. How do you know it's stinky? Like, does it have like a, like a scent thing on it? I don't know. Oh, here we go. The final. Well, technically, the maybe not the final zone, but final normal zone. Again, the percussion in this. <laughs> Definitely very fitting. I don't know, it just kind of... It probably doesn't make any sense, but it just, it's like, I don't know, it makes me think of, like, dirty machinery or something. In space. Dirty machinery in space. That's what this music makes me think of. some rings okay I can't I can't make it out with the little display I have here for the jet Man, I gotta get up early tomorrow and run My training continues. I've never been so sore in my life. I'm gonna do the impatient thing and just like skip a bunch of crap. Why does it keep, no, like this is, this is an evil, terrible bonus level. It'd be okay if you could, didn't have like a 99% chance of getting, you know, triple robot nicks. I gotta hit that middle one. Oh, Tails is hitting the other side for me. Tails, look at you go, buddy. What a Chad. What a bro. That little bounce room thing's kind of fun. I've always liked that. I'm just trying to collect rings. That's why I'm not. Actually, there we go. Bam, look at that. You're not going to get that in a Morio game, are you? You know why? Because Sega does what Nintendo... I like these little things, too. I mean, it makes it take way longer to get where you're going, but it still takes you where you're going. It's kind of cool. Oh no, it's the eyeball thing. Okay, I'm super sonicking. This is the most annoying freaking boss ever. I don't like it at all. And they put a variation of him in Mania, which 
brought back painful memories of my childhood in this zone. If I had emotions, I'd, pr I'd probably have been depressed. Here we go, we're in space! There's the planet! Maybe I should have played through one of the Freedom Planet games, like the first one. I didn't even think about that. Those are pretty cool too. I don't really like the the writing and the the, the voice acting for them necessarily, and that's you know that's no shade on the the stuff. It's, I just it, I don't know. They're going for a, a certain feeling there. I don't really care for it, but I think as a platformer, Freedom Planet games are pretty good. Also, Spark the Electric Jester. Those aren't too bad either. Well, the second one wasn't great, but they learned from their mistakes in the second one. And the third one was way better, so I'll give them credit there. I just didn't like the boss fights in it. It's like a fighting combo style thing, which isn't really my thing, but other than that. Pretty solid. At least, you know, to me. Oh my god, can I keep my rings? Can I get good? Oh, uh, here's where people get to see me eat dirt. I don't normally do so badly here, but I am just getting hit by everything I can. These little rocket things are just spanking me. That's okay. It doesn't really... I mean, I guess on the final boss it's kind of helpful, but I don't really need to go super either. Or hyper, I guess, in this case. It's just a unnecessary... Benefit, sort of. But it also works against you because of the, the way the movement is, so. I kind of like that you can just kind of see the planet there in the background like that. It's pretty, pretty super cool. I almost want to see like a more detailed release of this game someday. I doubt we'll get that though. Like for them to go back and redo some of the art and stuff. But it's not a big either. Oh come on. I guess I could have just skipped them, but I wanted to destroy that robot. Definitely I don't know what's with this track thing. Oh my god, finally a bonus level I could use. Yay, Tails grabbing his rings for me. We're actually sitting really pretty right now. 
I think this is the boss. I've seen people do some crazy stuff here and somehow hit him with like their jumping attacks and stuff. I didn't even know you could. Actually, I don't know, this thing's moving faster than me, so. I don't know how they pulled that off, to be entirely honest with you. They knew something I didn't. But that's fine. We'll beat this the funny way. No! Sucky. Messed that up really bad. Those spikes, man, you gotta watch out. before I could use it. Gosh darn it. Yay! We beat it! That boss either goes really easy or it's just a pain in the butt. Alright. Oh yeah, that's right. I gotta... It's his handy robot. I know that's not the fastest way to beat this, but... Depending on how you take out his fingers, you can make him flip you off. Look at that robot, though. Like, what the actual... Super makes that a little bit easier, but even that part's not hard. I wish I could be super for this part, though, because it would actually really make my day. We got four hits on him, though. That's pretty darn good. Tails is really earning his keep. Look at that! Tails just beating a snot out of Robotnik. I get in there, it's like the old one-two combo. I nail him, then Tails nails him right after. Then he goes off the screen. I don't know, that was... That was some nice stuff right there, if you ask me. Uh... Miss those missiles. Or not the miss the rings, gosh darn it. Jeez, I don't even know what I'm saying. Rockets and then you make him hit himself with his own rockets because 
Wow, well, okay, those balls are really getting annoying. Oh, there's a There. We destroyed that thing. I don't know if I've got enough rings to finish this. I need a really haul butt. Because I missed a lot of rings on my way here. You know, yeah, we, we might have some trouble on the horizon. We'll see. Picked up three there. Oh my god. Hit him. Hit him, Sonic. Oh, I think we got it. We got it. That's a game right there. Game set match. Checkmate. GG no re. Yeah, we clocked that in just under three hours. That's honestly what I would expect. Honestly what I would expect for a playthrough of this. Ah, always feels good to get that win under your belt, especially after about three hours of playing. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, man, it's almost a quarter after nine. I don't know if I should... Call it a day or keep going. There's Knuckles. He's happy he got his Master Emerald back. I'm not sure the mod for the music in this game does the ending stuff right. Because I think, I think this was mixed a little bit better. I just want it to be how it was with Sonic 3 and Knuckles with the cartridges. Brad Boxer right there. That's the reason why some of these slick tunes were in the game. Were in the game. these credits are done it's definitely gonna be pretty close to a three hour mark presented by Sega go a very successful and complete playthrough of sonic 3 and knuckles once again 
because I can't get enough of this game. This little cartoon's funny. A little flicky lands on the floating balloon thing. And it's like, I can peck it. He's like, no. He's like, yes. And then you hear it pop at the end. Like, oh man. Not that he doesn't deserve it, but oh man. <laughs> That was pretty cool, though. That was pretty cool. I think I will call it a night there, though. I mean, that was a three-hour stream. I think that's uh, fair enough. So anyway, thank you, Mr. Conflicts, for the subscription. And of course, as always, Itachi, thank you very much for stopping by and chatting. Always a pleasure. And for all you who end up watching us either on YouTube or here on Twitch. Thank you. And as always, take care. Hope you have a great rest of your day. But for now, this is Agent Ice, signing off.